those names sound good. Uh, it just gives a little bit of credibility about the team that you can think differently. You you already gone to the bigger ones, but I don't think that's um, that's like that should stop you from going anywhere. Right? I mean, I I haven't done my Stanford program until 2011. Okay, uh, a lot of time when I when I just finished either went out. I work, I did a MBA in one institute in Delhi, which was not very famous, right? So that means I shouldn't uh, go to a large company, right? <laughs> in, 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 if that is my career path, right? Uh, I studied in Bulaya College, I failed, <laughs> okay? So if you actually look at the educational path, then it was, it was just crazy. Uh, but it doesn't matter. I think what matters is the confidence that you have in yourself that you can do something and uh, the way you articulate your thought process it is so important i keep telling people this is the articulation is so important because when you articulate very well unless you're a geek and you're super intelligent like einstein or anybody else it's it's fine <laughs> you don't have to be articulate <laughs> but you know most of us are not and uh, then we we'll have to you know actually come across uh, and tell our idea in a very clear way. Okay. What else? Uh, so, like uh, today we have different sectors, services, manufacturing, or product based, we want to launch this product, or energy related startups, which is a need of today's uh, country, our country. So, like, do you think that services, sector startups, you give more importance to that, or you give equal importance to all the, if, the, if someone wants to launch this product, has a brilliant idea with this product, do you invest uh, in the manufacturing setup of that product, and you, or you look for some like services that are application or a, a service-based, software-based uh, thing, which is more feasible, which is more easier to, then you see a more easier returns. Yeah. In a uh, short span of time. Then, manufacturing, you need to wait for <coughs> some years, you have to see the growth, you have to see the market. So, do you generally uh, go for. Uh, it all depends on uh, the accelerator firm or venture capitalist that you're talking about. Uh, I know of venture capitalists who only invest in long gestation period patented manufactured products. Okay. So, in a company called Artiman Ventures, they're in white space investments. So, they like uh, products that have a high entry barrier. But when you say products which have a high entry barrier where you somebody cannot immediately copy or get into, then uh, it also means it's a long gestation period because there is least research and all of that cost associated with it, right? Um, but my company, for example, I would look for 